Well. Don't start sentences and not finish them. I didn't I start it. a sentence. You, did. you, you were saying you something. You said well. I don't. Let's roll it back. I don't think. Welcome back to Jenna's Ratchet Salon. Oh it's my. really not ratchet. This is a professional salon. It's ratchet. No, I got. It's... I can't believe I got an appointment. I thought this place was closed down. It looks closed down. The windows are boarded up. Why don't you let him go? No, he's my prisoner now. There's no escape. escape did you just say escape? <laughs> Escape the night. It's escape. Do they say the word escape? The word escape. <laughs> no, now you have it in my head. I know it's... No, we're breaking up. I can't date an escape. <laughs> it's escape, I know. Is this a, a picture or a picture? Picture. No, 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 get out! Here's what you're doing. What? You're saying, here are my buttons. Push them. <laughs> And I'm sitting right, here like, up. I like buttons. Julian used to get Brazilian blowouts. He's gotten, what, like three of them? And then when you bleach it, it'd be really dry and the texture was like kind of unmanageable, especially when you sweat. Oh, oh, oh. So he actually was gonna go into his hairdresser and get a Brazilian blowout tomorrow. And I was like, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. I'm pretty sure we can offer that at Jenna's Ratchet Salon if you'd like to do it today. I would like to do it today. Obviously, your hair is not like the curliest in the world. This isn't gonna be like an astonishing before and after, but I'm excited because I've never, I permed my hair, but I've I, never gone backwards and like straightened the hair. This is the one we're using. I'm you pretty sure they can see it without you holding up. No, you had to do the thing. Uh huh. This is technologically advanced. It's for virgins. No, no, virgin hair. <laughs> <laughs> it's good. Wait, did they have separate boxes for virgins and non-virgins? I don't know, maybe we need to go back. I might need to get the one for virgins. <laughs> You're gonna have to shampoo your hair. Are you okay with that? I mean, I didn't know that was part of this, but yeah. Don't get wet somewhere with you. I'm not gonna wash your hair. It's not in my services. This is the worst salon. I have to go <laughs> shower myself at the salon and wash my hair. Yeah. You tell the client to go into the back and wash their hair, and I'm just like literally bottoms off, just <laughs> kneeling over the sink, <laughs> just washing my hair. If you do that in the other room, I will film it, <laughs> you little shit. I'll do it. Are you allergic to perm? I don't know, I have to ask my doctor. <laughs> what? Do you go to your doctor? I have a very serious question. <laughs> Am I allergic to perm? How do you find that out? You would like a skin test. Go wash your hair. All right, I'm popping off the bottoms. No, 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 no. So I'm gonna finish reading these directions while Julian bottomlessly washes his hair and then we'll get this started. Are you excited? Yeah. <coughs> My hair's a virgin. <laughs> Julian! What? Julian! What? I went upstairs to go get my brush and he was standing there with absolutely no bottoms on and said, you gotta be bottomless to get to the top. Is that not what you said? Some will say it's a success story. Some will say it's a lifestyle. Peach, you want some? It's poison. Stop, no, you don't need gloves. I need them just in case. Stop. Like, can you ever just sit still and doing your hair? I'm just putting gloves on there. Stop. I'm not gonna tell you to stop again. Just shh. I'm pretty sure this is like the straightening stuff. It's a two-step process. What's the second step? I don't know. I don't feel like I'm in good hands. Is this okay if you get it on my scalp? Um, it's at a quarter inch on the scalp, but like, I'm not that talented. I feel it on my scalp. Stop, stop, stop. <laughs> stop it! Stop doing that. What time were you born? I don't remember. <laughs> what did the uh, lion say when he was about to have his photography equipment stolen? Okay, I don't know where this is going, Julie. He said, hey, that's my camera, rawr. <laughs> I care about you so much, but I don't know how to help you. Comb all the hair smoothly to one side, and then you comb it towards the other side, and then you comb it back, and I do that for 20 minutes. You just comb my hair for 20 minutes? Yeah. You know one time I um, I put a whole goop of mayonnaise in my pocket. Whatever the story is you're telling, it's, I know it's a lie. Can I eat cereal out of it later? No, it's not a bowl. It's for my... Hair dyeing I don't stuff. think you know what shapes are, because that's definitely a bowl. If there's cereal in it, then it is immediately for cereal. It's amazing how much straighter it is already. Boy, with that mustache, yeah, you looking like a snack. So wait, what happens right after this? I just go, I go drop the bottoms and shampoo it up? Keep your bottoms on. I, there's nothing you can do that's gonna leave, let me keep my bottoms on. I used to be a camp counselor and without fail, there was always one kid that would like say, I have to go to the bathroom and they pull their pants down and their shirt all the way up and you're just like, oh shit. <laughs> Hell right. yeah. Rinse hair thoroughly for seven to 10 minutes using moderate water pressure and making sure stage one is completely out of the hair. It looks really straight and beautiful. <gasps> 
put your pants on and go wash your hair for seven minutes. This looks like a lot straighter already. It does feel like a little dry, but that's because you didn't shampoo it and condition it, right? But you're gonna condition it later. So it's like, it, does, it doesn't It does feel like residue though. Burning my scalp when you have a heat on one spot for too long. I can see you mocking me in a viewfinder. <laughs> Oh! How do you feel? Good. Like a new woman? I feel like a new woman. I it know. doesn't feel chemical at all. Yeah, it feels nice. So now we are going to, as meticulously as we can, flat iron this beautiful hair on 450 so it melts. Oh my god, please don't pull my hair out of my head. He said do short ones and then do long ones. That's what I'm fucking doing, you little hair police. Wee you, wee you, pull over. Like your hair didn't fall out, it doesn't feel chemically. Are you not like impressed right now? I'm actually high key impressed with myself. I thought this was gonna sort of end badly. Just be careful, I don't want any hair to fall out. Why? Because I got an audition for a hair commercial mom. <laughs> oh yeah? Yeah. What hair commercial? It's called knees and shoulders. It's gonna compete with head and shoulders. <laughs> Yeah, it's not shampoo at all. It's a front for a drug cartel. Hey, when you're done with that, can you leave it on? I want to pop my panini in there. <laughs> it's so straight in the front. It looks so funny. Like, is that the look you were going for? That's how you usually do your hair, right? Is this what your hair looks like when your hairdresser does it? No. It looks almost like a bowl cut. Honestly, Julian with that mustache, this is very like Mitch from Pentatonics. Like, I, I'm digging it. I need you to not be on your phone and keep your head straight. <laughs> I don't know how hairdressers have any patience for people like that. Stop moving. Stop. Stop. Stop moving. It's not difficult. Stop. Close your <laughs> mouth and keep your head still. <laughs> Can you imagine if you acted like this at your real hairdresser? You look like like Anthony Q's from Red Hot Chili Peppers. Can you put your head up straight? Can I see? Oh, shit. Why are you laughing? Something's not right. You gotta... It's not moving. All right, Julian, are you ready for nah. stage two? Nah, what is this? This one only stays in for like five to seven minutes, okay? One thing I do know as a hairdresser, I don't think that there's anything more annoying than constantly reminding somebody to just like sit up. Oh, this is hot. Isn't this supposed to be hot? Does it feel good? Vine, am I right? I decided I don't like doing your hair. <laughs> You're so annoying. What am I supposed to do? It's so boring. Oh, I'm so sorry. Getting your hair done for free is so boring. Oh, thank you. I feel like straightening your hair chemically is a lot easier than curling your hair. I agree, way easier. You just comb it and it's straight. Whereas the curl, you have to like set it in a specific shape and spot. Are you fucking kidding me? Are you excited, Julian? Did you show a bottomless? I actually kept my bottoms on this time because I was cold and it was a bad idea. Everything got wet. Damn, you girl. Put product in it? You fucking did it. That looks so good. I'm not gonna straighten it. Like, you don't usually straighten your hair, right? No, no. This is like really good. I it's was, like, okay. I was really like nervous. This it's looks good. So smooth and like it feels like a real treatment. Like, n my hair when I permed it did not fucking feel like this. This feels like smooth and nice and not like a Damn, gross. Damn, you did a really fucking good job. Like, Wait, really? You like it? Yeah, like, um, I never thought that this would be. You thought I was trolling you and I said we're going to do this? Yeah, I never thought this would be like so doable at home. I don't know. Well, neither did I because like when they started getting popular, it was like this really expensive treatment seemed like a big long process that was hard, you know, but that's why I really wanted to try it because like, I don't know, I call y'all's fucking bluff. <laughs> you fucking nailed it, dude. I can't I even- I call y'all's bluff. I did this for $26. Your hair does not look or feel damaged. It feels better. Obviously, it really doesn't. It's smooth. <clears throat> That's one of the things that I'm surprised about is how like healthy my hair feels after all that. It's probably all the yeah, bottomless showers I, mean, I took. After, um, you know, a few washes or whatever, it's, it's definitely gonna feel like you had a chemical treatment on your hair. But for now, it feels and looks amazing. What do you think? It looks, I, I wanted to like, nitpick it but it looks goddamn fantastic <laughs> i feel like if you got like a nice little haircut then this it wouldn't be so like long and floppy i have a haircut tomorrow yeah. i have to tell my 
my barber yeah, that, that you did this. Can you give me a score out of 10? 9.2. You got deducted 0.8 for burning me multiple times. Play your hairdresser to wash the fuck out, bitch. <laughs> you coming for his brand? I'm coming for his man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really glad that you let me do it because I always felt like after the perm I was like well I know that a Brazilian blowout is sort of a similar process But I bet it's easier to do it straighter especially if you have short hair like for me It might take a lot longer This would have been brush. like twice as long for you and my hair can't handle it, it will die. Plus I don't think I need one because my hair is relatively straight, don't do that. Well, I'm really excited. To I'm, me, this is like a big deal. I think bottomless showers are the reason this turned out. You like it? It looks great. Oh. It, Seriously It looks though, almost as good as this. Nothing will look as good as that. <laughs> it's like they're in a, that group of hairs in a time capsule that doesn't get to get washed. It does get washed. That's why it's turning blue, because my blue hair is getting on it. A $26 Brazilian blowout? Are you fucking me? I'm, Where the fuck y'all come up with this $200 price tag? Like, I get it. Y'all's experience and licenses and labor is very valuable. But $26? I'll take it. We'll see how long it holds up. <laughs> will you keep us updated? Yeah. Will you ask Roth tomorrow? Yes, I will, get his, I will get his full-blown reaction. Oh my god, it's the five dollar tip. A ten dollar tip. Don't, don't spend it all in one place. I can get breakfast. Come on, son. I said don't spend it all in one place. <laughs> Thank you for having me in your salon. How do you feel that your secret is fully out in the open that you like? My Brazilian secret's blow? been out in the open. The moment I did this for the first time, you started telling people online, oh, he gets I he love spilling your oh, tea. Gets, it's not tea. I it's Gatorade. Spilling. I drink it in front of everyone. Is this still hot? Ow! Just Julian. kidding. It's not hot. It's not hot. See, I can put my tongue in it. We're so happy together. This is, this is the stress grip. Yeah, that's it. Make sure you subscribe to my channel. I put out new videos every Wednesday slash Thursday. That's subscribe my to her tip. channel with those. That's my tip. You gave that to me. Come, come, come. Stop. I hope you guys like this. I don't know. It's just an experiment for me, but I, I really wanted to see if I could do it. And I think it's really helpful information that it costs twenty six dollars and it's really not that difficult if you have someone help you at home. That's what I whip. think. Don't say whip and whip. I will undo, I will curl your hair. <laughs> Previously, my hair made my day worse. Okay, is that an info? Today, my hair is f -f fantastic. 1 800. I'm captured. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what I just said in Morse, but I definitely said something. With your eyes. Yeah. <laughs>